olden days, when girls were presented to society, that meant that they were presented as, okay, I'm now uh, available, I'm now ready for marriage. It, that's no longer what it means. It's just a, it's a, it's strictly a ball to, um, uh, to introduce girls, but it's, it's still, I mean, it's a debutante ball, but uh, it no longer has the stigma that, okay, look me over and I'm ready for marriage. <laughs> a lot of the young girls that attend the ball with, uh, watch their sister or their cousin or uh, a dear friend be presented and they get all excited and they think, oh, I can't wait till I'm a sophomore and I can put on, and if I'm invited to put on a long white dress and, and be presented. You know, this is a time when the girls are moving into a new place in their lives, but also the parents, because in some cases they may be the only child, and so they become really empty nesters. And uh, this is a, a special time with lots of good memories that they can have about how they work together for this, uh, for this end result, which is the ball, the, the culmination of all the activity. I guess you could say it's a real honor to be invited. I feel like it makes girls have confidence in themselves, having to get up on that stage in front of all those people. So it definitely helps boost, boost the confidence. Some of our honors, bronze award, silver award for Girl Scouts of America. I think um, this is more of a choice than, than like being forced in how like, if you think it's cool, then by all means do it. Try to get, be, become a debutante. But if you don't know what it is, do research. You will like what you see. Well, I liked what I see, but I'm not guaranteeing if you like what you see. Well, I think um, we are still in a place where we want to teach uh, some of the finer graces and we want to know how to behave in all kinds of settings. Let's say we go to visit the president. Those skills and those uh, manners are still required in those kinds of places. And so why not continue to teach them? But it's really the grace and the civility that uh, may be lacking in our, in our society that we need to continue to um, teach our young people.